Hey there, welcome to the first episode of the Wizard Skating Tutorial Series. So this is the first episode where I'll be teaching you the Gazelle, which is a regular move used to switch from usually backward to facing front way. This can be done facing front too, but it is uh, quite harder to do, um, mainly because the knee don't bend well facing front, and you have to push a lot more. So it, it is usually the first step because it's allowed to do the lion, which is the one-footed way of doing the gazelle. I am Florian from Too Many Wheels, and let's go! So the gazelle is a nice first move to learn because it makes you learn your edges and your rocker too. So the rocker is when you, are, when you put your weight on the front or on the back of the skate, and the edges in when you put it on the sides. So I'll show you what is the gazelle. So before talking uh, uh, in depth of the edges, uh, some terminology. So when you are on the right of your right foot, this is the outside edge. And the same uh, when you are on the left of your le left foot. So outside because outside of the body. And the inside edge is, uh, well, when the right foot is bent on the left. So the first move you should do is to simply go backward with one foot in front of the other and to draw a circle. Like this. So you should bend on the way uh, the, towards your front foot. So if your front foot, mine is the left, I should bend to the left. And then with your uh, shoulders, you should look outside the circle. Like this. You should also have your hips facing the same way as the shoulders. So like this. So first you do the circle and then you should close it. So this will look like it, like this. When going backward, you have to keep in mind that you should be on the front rocker and not on, you should put your weight on your toe instead of your heels. Like this. To illustrate, not that much. <laughs> instead of this. So you are on the front wheels. To close the circle and to stop, you should put your weight back. And putting your weight back will uh, automatically close the circle. So, now, now that you close the circle, you should be in a position similar to this one. And you should put your weight on this foot so this one can turn more easily. So when it will turn, it should do so to a uh, position. This yes. nice stop. And now this move should put it in a kind of an eagle position to go like this. So to review this and this. The other foot, once this one has turned, should follow like this. To do this, you put your weight on this one once it once it turned, so this one can move freely. So this will look like it. So the use of the rocker is really important here, um, and this this is what you should focus on to uh, make the turn easier, as well as uh, move your weight on one side and on the other. To make the turn easier, you can use your shoulders to lead the way. So they should look like this. You can use your arm like this, to draw your shoulders back way. Okay, so this was a quick tutorial for the gazelle. I hope my English is not too messy. And um, don't hesitate to put in comments um, if something was not clear, uh, so I could maybe make a better tutorial later on. Um, I will next cover the lion, which needs the gazelle to be done. 
um, and yeah, um, don't forget to subscribe uh, and like if you want more content. See you.